zero emission aircraft is really about Airbus having the ambition to bring a, uh, an aircraft which can fly with no impact on the climate to reality by 2035. Uh, we see it as a huge business opportunity. We see it as something that the airlines are asking for from us. And on top, we see it as a moral obligation that we need to bring climate neutral flying to society. Hydrogen is really interesting because it can be produced with renewable energy. It's essentially a surrogate for renewable energy on board the aircraft. On top, as the world goes towards a Paris Agreement, which I think we all believe is necessary, Hydrogen is going to be used by several industries in order to bring down its CO2 emissions. The cost is going to go down and that makes it also very interesting for aviation. The next five years are really important to us for developing the technology that's required for a zero emission aircraft. We're going to be developing the technology, testing that technology on ground and what we're also going to start seeing are flight demonstrators which means we're going to take that technology, put it into aircraft and fly it, test it to its limits and really understand the performance. The three concept planes that we've revealed today all have hydrogen propulsion systems on board. Uh, what they show is the huge versatility that hydrogen can bring the aviation industry because hydrogen is working from less than 100 seat aircraft all the way up to 200 plus seat aircraft with varying ranges. Airbus had set itself a huge ambition to deliver a zero emission aircraft uh, to its customers by 2035. Honestly though, we can't do this on our own. We need regulators, airports, energy suppliers, technology partners, and it's through working with all of these colleagues that really this is going to become reality.